I love it when a film just starts. I don't need an introduction. I don't need a backstory. I just need the screen to light up and boom, I'm in the action. And that's what Wrecked does. Adrian Brody stars as a man who wakes up in a wrecked car in the middle of the forest with no road and no idea how he got there, complete with amnesia. This film is a thriller that just starts off by grabbing you by the face and sticking you in the movie. Even though Adrian Brody has won an Oscar, he's also known for hunting King Kong and Predator, so he's still got the chops to pull something like this off, and hell yes he does. In Wrecked, he plays a broken man with no memory of who he is, alone in a wilderness that is trying to kill him. So he takes you through the whole trip. We see fear, we see hope, and then we see him sink into madness, and it's Brody making it seem real. That's where this movie just pulls you in. Like I said, sticks your face right into the film because Brody just engages you with his performance of a man truly desperate, full of fear, with no hope, still struggling to survive. Director Michael Greenspan knows what he is doing in Wrecked. He keeps the camera nice and tight on Adrian Brody without any takeaway shots or scenes not involving the character because the whole film is from Brody's point of view and that's where we get this wonderful performance. Also, he didn't go to some crazy out there wilderness that just looks monstrous itself. It's just wilderness. It's the woods you could find right behind your suburb or down from the complex or go a little bit deeper into the park. But when you have no idea where civilization is, that's where the fear is and that's what allows Brody to bring this character to reality and to life. Wreck does not live up to its title because it's not a wreck. This is a well-made film from beginning to end and Adrian Brody is phenomenal. This film, however, did bother me enough that I'm kind of afraid of losing my memory and being lost in the woods. So I've written all of my personal information in every pair of my underwear, including the thongs.